when Amr ibn al-As, the companion of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, was governor of Egypt, his son, the son of the authority, took part in a horse race against another Qipti, meaning a Coptic boy of Egypt. The Coptic boy won the race. And so he was upset, so he picked up a whip and he hit the boy, relying on his father's authority, knowing that the kid would not be able to hit back. So the young Coptic boy complained to his dad and his dad was aggrieved and he traveled where? To the city of Medina in search of who? Amir al-Mu'mineen Umar radiallahu anhu, the caliph of the Muslims, in search for justice. Umar was devastated when he heard this news that a Muslim had assaulted a Coptic because he was relying on his dad's power. So Umar ibn al-Khattab wrote a letter to Amr ibn al-As saying to him, as per what follows the moment you read this letter, you come to me, you and your son, to the city of Medina. Amr ibn al-As packs his bag, he arrives in Medina. And when all of them were now in front of Amir al muminin Umar, Amr ibn al-As, his son, the Coptic boy, and his father, Umar hands over a whip to the Coptic boy and he says to him, if you wish, you can hit the child or the kid that hit you. And so he, uh, he cashed that check and he took the whip and he began to hit the boy, hit the boy until he felt as if retribution had been delivered. He felt good. Then Umar ibn al-Khattab said to the boy, young man, if you wanted to hit his father, if you wanted to whip his dad, Amr ibn al-As, the companion of the Prophet sallallahu I wouldn't have stopped you because his son only hit you relying on his authority. And then Umar, he turns to the governor of Egypt, Amr ibn al-As, and he said to him those phenomenal words that you have come across. He said to him, since when have you taken people as slaves when their mothers bore them as free? <laughs>